will do well. The favor of God, the God who opens the way, who breaks the way, will go before you, will encircle you, will change your story, will elevate your brand, will prosper your vision. Welcome to Kingdom Leaders Global Alliance. Join us as we build saints to become voices, visionaries, and vessels of God's kingdom. God bless you. My job, my Lord. Hey, this is my favorite part of this meeting. And we're going to run through it very quickly. This is why we've come. Prepare for an impartation now. Ela baba korobos, ela kosa, ela kroso prokodo sama. Matele kedo saya, ela korobele frete dele kadu sata ya. Ela la raga da da da, raga da da da, raga dele borosa. Ela koria se tele lele koria se baria teba ya. Sanda da da kore kedo saba ya. Maskubaria teba ya. Ira maleko saba ya. Ele preke baro sa talele lo saba. Ke baria telele lo. Uda yela ba. Rokoto da da saba ya. Spread out more. I need to spread out more. Thank you. Oh, Sate. Sate Lebolo Saya. So, Tada Baragada Basso. No, Kogere Yedo Sutaya. Sate Lebolo Sabai. Kado Shado. Hallelujah. Now, this is the point where if it's not your thing for you, I believe the meeting is done. And from here on, you can start to actually experience what God has already ordained for you at the level of your faith. 
Because what is about to happen, according to the specific instructions that we've received, is that you are going to get an opportunity to come right over here and take a portion of this anointing oil as a mark and a memorial of covenant. And you put it over yourself and I will keep praying over you as the people come out. Let me tell you, I'm a child of the anointing. I'm a product of the anointing. The full story of my life and exploits, everything that the Lord has given me the opportunity to do in my youth is connected directly to the anointing. Ministry by the anointing. Public policy by the anointing. Coaching by the anointing. Leadership by the anointing. Business by the anointing. Pastoring by the anointing. And stepping into multi-million dollar opportunities have come by the anointing. I've never reckoned myself to be the best in the park, the smartest. And I know too many other saints like me out there. We are back on campus to remind you that this is the building ground for destiny. I'm back on OU to tell you this is a revival headquarters. I'm back on OU to tell you that though your beginning be small, your latter end will greatly increase. And I want to invite you into the commonwealth of the anointing, a life that is underguarded by the supernatural. Miracles unfolding, a preparation for destiny. I'm telling you what is about to be released on you today is so strong that it will still be speaking many decades to come for some of you you will start to get news from home of an entirely different testimony from what they have previously experienced because what is coming on you will actually spread and begin to impact your family impact your health your academics your ministry your vision your future that's where we are and as we set you up with, you know, the guidance as to how it will work, I'm thinking maybe uh, it's going to start from over here. The ushers working with DTB will specify to say this is how we're moving row by row and this is how we're going back up. As that entire experience is going on, I beg you, don't be an onlooker. Don't be an onlooker. Pray from your heart. Because it actually just takes one moment in the supernatural for God to place a mark on you that truly transforms your life forever. That's the power of the anointing today. That's the power of the Holy Ghost. This is the biggest part of why I have come. And I'm going to be reading out to you um, just very quickly dimensions you will experience and specific uh, promises and prophecies hanging over you as you partake of this anointing service is going to truly impact your life so weightily that before 2023 is over you're going to be a clear sign and a signpost of what God can do with a yielded vessel can you give it a better amen I didn't hear your amen number one the Lord has said to us that tarnished gold is going to be purified by the goldsmith today and buried talent, wasted opportunities, gifts on your inside that have been dormant. They are going to come alive by the anointing. So who you are at your finest and your best will emerge on the account of this conference. Can I get a better amen? We also know in the spirit that the Lord said he is waging war with that which has waged war against you. There is a warrior's anointing that is emerging on the account of this conference. Some of you have been in difficult situations that even you now start to perceive them as generational in nature. And you are so sometimes so afraid of what will be in the future if things are continuing this way. And the Lord says to me to tell you that I will arise and I will put to flight the, uh, the enemy oppositions that have waged a, a war against your life. Number three, we know in the spirit that there is a consecrating anointing that is resting on you today. What that means is that God is setting you apart 
and no matter how dark it gets in your generation, you will always shine as light. That is a place for your best amen, actually. That you will not be corrupted by the evil of your generation. That you will not be corrupted by the darkness of this age. In the name of the Lord Jesus, a consecrating anointing that sets your heart apart for the Lord. That sets your heart apart for the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Number four, the Lord spoke to us concerning ancient mantles. Ancient mantles. Ancient mantles. As it was in the days of old, you're going to see a replication of powerful dimensions of the anointing that rested on patriarchs in scripture and in dispensations before us. There are catering comments that will emerge from this meeting again. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Dimensions of grace and the anointing and mantles that will become activated for your life and your destiny. At number five, we also reckon that this is an ordination meeting. And interestingly, I'm going to actually be praying for you before you come out. I have been instructed to pray right where you are for a category of people who feel a call to ministry. And right where you are, there's going to be a strong release of an ordination anointing that would actually commission you in the direction of your ministry mandate in the name of Jesus Christ. At number six, the Lord has said to us that in this meeting, he's binding the strong man and setting the captives free. No, that deserves a better amen. What that means is if there have been cycles of addiction and affliction in your life, if you have been a captive to sin, a captive to health challenges, a captive to fear and nightmares, a captive to repeated patterns of negativity, if you've been a captive to anything that Jesus Christ did not redeem you, uh, anything that Jesus Christ has redeemed you out of, the Lord says the strong man is bound, the siege is over, the war is ended, and your victory is assured. I said your victory is assured. Your victory is assured. In the name of Jesus, finally, at this moment, and I know there is much more the Lord is doing, as you partake of this anointing service, your eyes will open. Oh, your eyes will open. You know that moment as they walked on the way to Emmaus with the Lord Jesus, they didn't know who he was. And scripture said when they asked him, how come you are the one who doesn't know everything that has happened to Jesus? He said to them, oh, ye who are slow of heart. Those of you who are slow of heart. And he started to expound to them from the law unto all the prophets, everything written in scripture concerning himself. When he broke bread, their eyes opened and they saw him. What did they say? They said, did our hearts not burn within us? How, wow, no wonder it's Jesus. Did our hearts not burn within us? Today your heart will burn. Your eyes will open. And what that means is that prophetic gifts are being activated. I said prophetic gifts are being activated. This is the way that I live. I'm not giving to too much English. I don't have any experience that has not been shaped up by eternal life. And that is what God has told us to bring to this land. And the joy is that many of you are already walking in dimensions of revival with the Lord. And he wants to take it to a whole new level. He wants to take it to a whole new level. He wants to take it to a whole new level. Would you go up in tongues in this moment and e express your desire before the Lord? We have such a short time, so make it count. Qualify your desires before the Lord. Karaba se plagada na makorasa. Ela baba belegedos. Abragadisa korasa. Is this the finishing army? Is this the finishing generation? Ora baba baba koregedos. Eparia telelele beregedos kaya ye. Ragadosa bibelo saya ya ila mela sata ragada baragados you need more intensity you actually need more intensity eboko saya ya era baba ya santolo kodos and bereke berus kodos ragadele bereke dos 
Emma Corobo, so pregnant, so you are the delegate of the Russo boy. Who shall I candle, Saba? Emma, so to look at those at the bar. Embraga delegate, Barada delibero, so near. There's a song we are people of your presence. And we will wait, we will stay. You know it? We are people of your presence. We will wait. He wants us to do that song. We will stay. Yes. We fix our gaze on you, Jesus. We all of us will do that song on behalf of a generation. Would you lift your hands and your heart to the Lord? That's our song of consecration. On behalf of a generation. Raise your voice. Let it rise. Like a holy chorus. Let's do it together. Let's raise our sound. We fix Jesus. And we, we are people, we are people, we are people of oh, your presence. We will wait, we will wait, and we will stay, and we will stay. We fix our gaze on you, we fix our gaze on you, Jesus. We will wait, and we will we are, we are people. people. We are. Sing it from your heart unto the Lord. We will wait. We will wait. We will stay. We will. We fix our gaze on you. Fix our gaze on you, Jesus. We will wait, and we will stay. Of your presence, we will wait, and we will stay, and we, we will, will stay. stay. We fix our gaze on you. We fix our gaze on you. Yes, we will wait. Yes, we will wait. We will wait, and we will stay. 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 If you're called to ministry right where you are, lift up your two hands. Whether you even feel like a spiritual babe, but there's a burning in your heart, it's clear to you or it's getting clearer. Lift your hands. Lift your hands. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Oh, so it, this is the exact confirmation. He said there will be many ministry gifts in the meeting. He said there will be so many ministry gifts in the spirit. Expect a baptism now. Expect a baptism. You require fire to confront the opposition of this age. Pray your heart out in the spirit. Expect a baptism. Expect a baptism. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Woo! Look at mighty ministry gifts all over the auditorium. Look at how packed this place is with ministry gifts. 
What a blessing for this generation. Different expressions. Expect the power of the Holy Ghost. Express, expect a new revival. Expect a new empowerment. Expect a new ordination. Woo! Of your presence. And we will. We will. Woo! Yes! And deliver the Gaboya. Oh, the de 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 Korea. Ya, 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 Jesus, Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Lord, I pray over these vessels. You said to me that they will be in abundance. I'm in awe of what you are doing, oh Father. Precious Holy Spirit, it's your hour. It's your moment. And we submit ourselves to your reign and your revival. In the name of Jesus, carry us on the wave and the wind of the Spirit. Concerning every single one of you, whatever level of spiritual maturity, whatever level of clarity, whatever level of understanding that you have currently about your calling in Christ Jesus, I declare over you a new level of revelation. In the name of Jesus, a new level of revelation. I declare that the eyes of your understanding open up and you come into a glorious discernment and understanding of your assignment and your mandate in Christ Jesus. I declare that like the righteous, you are bold as lion. I ask for an impartation of spiritual courage right now. I see eyes opening up. I see eyes opening up. When you look into the word, you will see Christ. In the name of Jesus. For those of you, and I can see that burning so strong, asking the Lord for fathers, mentors, leaders, forerunners, and you're saying, I don't want this journey to be a lonely one. Father, connect me. He says to tell you, I'm firmly establishing your feet in your own prophetic family. You will be discerned by those I have raised for you and your growth will be supernatural. You are firmly planted. You are delivered from the orphan spirits. You will never be excluded from the company of saints. You will be raised by fathers, mentors, leaders, spiritual guide, and those who have a heart for the Lord. He will place ahead of you shepherds like Christ. And more importantly or equally importantly, I declare that you are raised as a shepherd like Christ for your generation in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. We fix our gaze. We fix right our on gaze. you. On you, Jesus. GTB. How do we begin? And we from here. We are people. And we climb from here. Of okay. your presence, Lord. Your presence. We will. And we will say. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. I want to recommend, uh, is it possible that we come this way and come this way? What do you think? But how do we go? If this center was open, we'll come this way and go this way and come this way and go this way. The anointing oil is just a symbolic connection to what God is doing in the spirit. And as you interact with the oil, put it on your forehead, return to your seat and continue to pray. All the while, I'm also going to be praying over you. 
And for those of you who are in the auditorium, you might even hear things that will be your own word and you can continue to steward it in the place of prayer. And we trust the Lord to give us speed and angelic support and order as we move quickly through that process. Um, Director Toyin, I have a feeling that we can make this more. I don't know. But let's see how quickly it moves. I'm feeling like, okay, but it's moving. Okay, no worries. Hallelujah. You ready for what is yours today? You ready for what is yours? You ready for what is yours? You believe in the power of the Holy Spirit to shape up your life over and beyond the limitations of the flesh. Glory to God. I declare grace over you in the name of Jesus. I declare you will prosper and accomplish your divine destiny. The hand of the Lord is mighty upon you. Oh, you arise, fulfill your purpose. Oh, you arise, accomplish the purposes of God. Let revival break out on this land in the name of Jesus. Father, thank you for vessels, vessels of grace, vessels of revival in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 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 A new season of grace. I hear grace in the spirit. Father, let there be an outflow and an outbreak of a new anointing. A new anointing today. A new anointing today. I can hear tongues. New tongues. Receive new tongues. Receive new tongues. Hallelujah. New tongues. Yes. Carabalos and delegates. New tongues, new enablement, new anointing, new capacity. Pray your heart to the Lord in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. And no carrier delegate, Yaba, Emma Masu Paraba, La Coragados, Bayante, Bayante, Ella Corodosa, in a decade, Loso Maria delegadosa, a carrier's cabaloga de Beriata, Mako delegate, Mako Susulande. Father, raise for yourself a generation for your glory. A people after your heart. Father, raise for yourself a people of your glory for this hour, in this generation, in the name of Jesus. I declare that your gaze is set on the Lord. Your gaze is set on the Lord. Your gaze is set on the Lord. I declare that you choose the Lord. I declare you prosper in his will. In the name of Jesus. It is your hour and your time. Lord Obaraka Sapaya and let the Reberegadon in the name of Jesus. Let us so toya and the Regabaskabaya. Let us so toya day in the name of Jesus. Multiply, prosper, do the will of God in the name of Jesus. Allah Karadada, let Regende Leborusa, Otani Gaba, Makoyo Degede. 
and not that they look at those songs. We're going to set our eyes on you, Lord. Yeah, we are soldiers. Yes, we will wait. We will wait on your command. We fix our gaze Father, thank you for grace. Thank you for capacity. Thank you for the anointing. Mightily released. I declare you will stand in purpose. You will fulfill God's purpose for your life. You will win on all accounts. Nothing stands in your way of divine accomplishment. In the name of Jesus, concerning this world, I declare the enablement. You are preserved from the evil of your time. In the name of Jesus, let grace be multiplied. 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 In the name of Jesus. Otoporos Gaba, Ragadalagade, Empelo Kotosa, Imala Brada Kragados, Ragaba Baba, Ele Bregadela, Rogodo Kabele Sota, Lord Grace, Lord Grace, Lord of Multiplication, Victor of our sin, Victor of the works of the flesh, in the name of Jesus, Atoko Bella, Imalo Kosa, Hanaba Baba. We fix our eyes on you, Jesus. 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 In the name of Jesus, a people after the heart of God. In the name of Jesus, I declare you are a mountain born and you advance the kingdom purpose with focus. In the name of Jesus, Olokonova Subaya and Ababa, Ragada Dadani Gada, in the Brigade de Berus, Tania Tabaya. We fix our gaze on you, Lord. Da da in the name of Jesus, grace, take that which is yours, fulfill your purpose in God. Allah Dabarako, we are stewards, Allah Krodos Koparia, Sabale Gedos, Evaria de Preke de Legodosia, La Koshaya, and Ababa Belegade, Oskoporo Gonea, Sayale Gede. At another that we are the dose of Macaria de Lebos and Sabrocodos, Ragada Baragada. Yes, we will wait on you. Yes, we will wait on you. Yes, we We are soldiers. We are soldiers. Oscar de Legado, Eleka de Leberega, we are so boy. Oh, Rada, Dada, Liboro, Kosa, Bayaya, Ele, Korea, Skelega, Neberu, Saba, Marababas, Kabele, Vero, Abragada, Dade, Saba, Abragadia, Lord, Lord, see your generation. We are set apart for your purpose. Look at us. We will do your will. We will stand in line for the will of God. Father, we are consecrated unto your holy mandate in the name of Jesus. Oh, Eleborosa, Rakata Kabaragados. Thank you, Jesus. Oskoto Bariasa, Elamando Koya, Negade, Apepe Bekorodosia. Thank you, Lord. Grace. Thank you, Lord. And don't carry us, Kaba. Rabba, Babe, Bekoso, Logodos. And the Berias, Kabarias, 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 Kelania. In the Dose, Taya, Neba, and Melokoto, Berege, Biatoba. 
hearing ears, seeing eyes, a heart of understanding. In the name of Jesus, oh Soto Loborogodo, Makaya Dada Dali Borosa, seeing eyes, oh God, hearing ears, oh God. Thank you, Lord. And the barriers, the Balegado, Saya. And the Kadaba, Makande Legade, Escato Legade, Maria de Legado, Saba, Rakata, Dada, Nicola, Dado, Saba, Elamama, Saba. Oh, we are soldiers, soldiers of the living God, of your presence, Lord. Yes, we will wait, Jesus. Yes, we will wait, Jesus. We fix our gates up. 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 Thank you, Lord. Yes, we will wait. We will wait on you, Jesus. 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 We will wait in the name of Jesus, arise and shine and fulfill your divine destiny. Loborogos, Ebregade, Los, Ados, Rogodos, Ibragada, Alabadiasa, Eleberegade, Eleboros, Adabariakia, Eladadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadad
Makore de 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 leberu sabaya. Abba bebe keria kuria satai. Ela bere de 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 liaya. Thank you, Lord. If you're here with your prayer partner, a covenant friend, a ministry partner, a person that you've discerned in the spirit to be an important part of your emergence and you've been building that friendship or you're here with the person you're caught in. I feel so strongly in the spirit to announce to you that God is activating kingdom partnerships. Some of them will still be speaking many, many, many decades to come. Many, many decades to come. If you can find that person in the hall, go to where they are and stand together. Then you lift your hands together. If you're already standing around yourselves, lift your hands together. The Lord showed me an image of saints coming together in kingdom partnership and covenant alliance and he said where I find just two anytime I find just a minimum of two I am going to wield such influence and wreck to the kingdom of darkness and we are ready it is right about time that a new generation of revivalists emerge across OAU those who will stand for the kingdom agenda and who will say not on our watch no to pornography, no to lost sexualisms, no to evil agitations, no to occultism, no to delays, no to materialism, no to the powers of this age, no to mental afflictions and depressions, no to suicidal ideations. Lift up your hands, ministry partners, covenant friends, believers in a godly union, in a relationship God has shown to you, your prayer partners, sisters of faith, agree together in this moment. Let's make it a consecration. I can see an image in the spirit before we go on to the second part of that prayer. For those of you already in such relationships of destiny, can you cry out to the Lord? Father, use this relationship for your glory. Use this collaboration for your glory. And if your own friends are not here, mention their names and pray for them. For some of you, it's even with your biological siblings. Pray and declare, Lord, use this alliance to wreak havoc in the kingdom of darkness. Use us on OU campus for your glory. For your glory. Ibaragados. Ah, pray with understanding, I beg you, beloved. Mandu Koras Kapelegedos, use us for your glory. Make us your threshing instruments, your battle axes. Make us your vessels, Lord, to advance the light, to turn on the light where there has been darkness. Some of you are ministry leaders together. Out to the Lord. Father, let this connection facilitate your kingdom agenda. Use us for your glory. In the name of Jesus, declare that Satan will have no influence in that relationship. You will not be distracted or derailed. It will serve God's purpose. We have a short time. Let's make the most of it. Manda Korea Zande Leora. If you have a praying community, begin to pray for that praying community now. Pray for that praying community. And say, let this become a mountain of the Lord. Now begin to pray for your fellowship. Every single one, call the name of your fellowship on this campus. Declare that this is the mountain of the Lord. Prayers are answered on this mountain. Revelation comes forth from this mountain. Deliverance is wrought on this mountain. Revival is awakened on this mountain. God blesses us with shepherds after his heart. Cry out, cry out, cry out. Oh, Nana Corazzo, Ele Berusa. We are here to make a mark on this land. Revival is activated again in the name of Jesus. Rukotototia. It's time to pray for your pastors and your leaders. Begin to declare their names and pray for their heart. They have a heart after Christ. Otoporogodusa. Caninos. Imbrigi 
Kidigi Baru Zotea, Emma Makele Bregados, Ila Gado Sacradiasa, Ela Bereberia Lega de Berusaba, Sayas, Ele Beros, Rudusinana. Father, use this alliance for your glory. And thank you for these leaders after the heart of God. Pray for the churches on Obafemi Awolo University campus and all across Ileife. God's love to Banakul International, Sanctuary of Hope. Pray for Living Word, Christ Love Fellowship everywhere around town. All the churches expressed in this land. Pray that they will become an alliance for the kingdom agenda. Sato Sibaria Telela. And Abaragados, I see kingdom alliances, kingdom alliances, Jethro and Moses, Deborah and Barak, Elizabeth and Mary, Elijah, Elisha, David and his men, Jesus and his disciples, alliances of destiny, David and Jonathan, Atoko Paria Geba. Menene Maria Lo Coroso Zoha, Imbregados, Mordecai and Esther, Atabere Geberia Saw. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Subande la Gadabaha. I saw the yoke of death broken i saw it vividly the yoke of death broken and you're going to pray in agreement with what the lord has done no more suicidal ideation on ou campus no more mental distress and depression on ou campus no more death through sicknesses or any means on ou campus that ravaging of young destiny stops forever. In the name of Jesus. Go up to the Lord and declare in the name of Jesus, we enforce the life-giving covenant of Christ over Abafemi Awolowo University. We enforce the life-giving covenant of Christ and we, we, we chase out the torment of the enemy. Ebre don frasca bariando selega de bahande. Meka rada dali gadida do sata. Embre gada gabaru zuzula di aste. Ele berede do perianduna karias gabaha. Regede son trasca tijala dande. Thank you, Lord. Sada baragabaha. One of the very significant purposes of the anointing that you have received that rested on your spirit today is actually to activate the spirit of excellence. The spirit of excellence. Ah, it's a good place to rejoice actually. It's a good place to rejoice. There's a spirit in man. I said there's a spirit in man. The spirit of God. And Okoria Satabaha gives him understanding. There's a vital force of intelligence in man. genius is about to be supernaturally unlocked I'm telling you what I have lived in and experienced materially indeed I have experienced being wiser than your teachers again and again and again and again and again so I'm 
I'm going to give you a moment to make that personal. Mm. To make that personal. Instead of picking a, a signal in my spirit. Imole deo okun kyo parades Imole deo okun parades Imole deo okun kyo Wisdom to understanding to knowledge. Sing it, rejoice it, rejoice, rejoice. Your light is here. excited than you. Rejoice like a genius. Hallelujah. Before I lead you to the specific prayer to pray, to harness this dimension as we start to close out the anointing service, I feel so strong in my spirit to activate a yoke-breaking dimension. Especially for those who have experienced persistent challenges academically. So while we're closing our eyes in this moment and the, the light song is just cruising nicely underneath, I want to stand as God's prophet and actually operate in that very precious breaker anointing that he brought here to this meeting in generous supply. If you've been challenged academically, if you've faced difficult experiences, you've struggled to understand and you know it at a spiritual level that indeed it is possible for understanding to be locked. To feel like the heavens are closed. Not to get it even though you try so hard. If you've ever been there then you know understanding is spiritual. You know understanding is spiritual. So I'm going to ask you to lift your hands because I came here for you. The Lord brought something here for you that will cancel out that warfare and open you up to a whole new season in your life. The entrance of his word, the entrance of the prophetic word, it gives light and understanding even to the simple, the seemingly simple who don't get it, 
get it when God comes. It's a new dawn for you. So carry us and the barrier calls about. Men the calls a carababa Korea then a Monday. So tulia keep a bedo kabande. Ragadele koya dinus ata yaliana. I've come after the order of light. And I declare over everyone in this room and online facing this peculiar challenge, struggling academically, lacking understanding, facing repeated failure experiences. I declare light in the name of Jesus. I pray for you as an oracle of the living God and I declare in the name of Jesus that you have eyes that see, ears that hear, a heart of understanding. Eyes that see, ears that hear, a heart of understanding. Eyes that see, ears that hear, a heart of understanding. I invite you into an anointing for witty inventions, an anointing for extraordinary innovations, an anointing for unusual understanding, an anointing for supernatural genius. I declare that your mind is the mind of Christ. Come into this dimension of ancient wisdom that even before you are... Thank you for listening. We are sure you have been tremendously blessed. To connect with Kingdom Leaders Global Alliance, please visit our website, www.kingdomleadersglobal.org. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, Kingdom Leaders Global Alliance, for our video resources. And follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at Kingdom Leaders Global. God bless you.